Hey, what's up? Jay here, of Bogart's channel, and today we are gonna continue playing Stranded Deep. Okay, so this is the 11th episode. Wow. And last episode, guys, I managed to make another block of my of my raft. Look at that beautiful, beautiful anchor my side so anytime anytime now I can stop where I want to stop and don't get carried away with a sea current and also I discovered that I can attach a stick or a hook and put the lantern onto it so now we are sailing we are sailing with with light, which is good, and it's very comfortable to never to row anymore. Just a smooth sailing drive. This is amazing. just enjoy the moon and the night sky going back to my island I can already see the light of my lantern isn't that cozy oh yeah it's quite fast. The raft is very fast. Wow. Okay, so lower the sail. And drop the anchor. See? Doesn't move any. Anything. Any inch. What happened to my... To my plants Is, are they dead mm -hmm. my yucas are doing good see we're gonna drop what we looted and also I have some corrugated scraps I'm gonna make uh, another garden out of this this collection that extra light I'm wondering what happened to my garden potato yes I have potato and harvest our fiber sleeves okay this one oh my god what's happening I need to know this I need the research is happening or can you just drop in the comment guys uh, how do you fix this it's dead whoa oh my god have ourselves a drink hey also I'm so I'm so uh, I feel good about the smoker the food is very, what do you call it? It's very prolonged. Uh, it doesn't rot easily as the, the cook, the just cooked ones. Okay, we're gonna have a sleep. Hopefully, light is not yet. It's not yet. Uh, shun. there so what are we going to do today we can do uh, we can build a, another garden but this is my problem how do you solve this I don't know how how or what to do with this just gonna make another garden ok 
Okay. Got this one. Make some sticks for the garden. And fronts. More for the water. Saplings and fibrous leaves, usual stuff. All right. This game can be so rep repetitive sometimes; it becomes so boring. But if you're the one playing it, it really doesn't feel like that. You also get to be immersed in its in its survival invoking uh, what's the right words to say you get so immersed in the, the the idea of survival and get to create things out of the simple elements that you can just find in the wild almost like you're I remember the feeling of a kid, you know, uh, that is very excited to do so many things out of so simple, simple things. Create stuff up out of the things that you find in nature. The excitement of it. It invokes that that part of our human psyche. For me, I don't know what about you. Okay. Uh. Mhm. Mm I still don't know many things about this game. I'm just learning from time to time also watching some videos of other players who play this game and watch how they do things and get to know what what they are doing how they do it discover how to do like the gardening one I learned it from someone I don't don't even know how to how to yes this one the hole you can't build a garden without the hole <laughs> uh, how do you okay it's it's got slanted maybe I'm just gonna build here and one space for the one space for the path have the sticks and the latchings for another beautiful garden here but whoa this one's perfect there you go uh-huh we have some I think I left there's the spoiled potato so we're gonna put this one first it might spoil away Alright, what can we do about this? Do we need to plant another one? So we're gonna... Uh-huh. Clear this one. Maybe the potatoes, if they're... If we can harvest some. We're gonna plant it there. Instead of the yucas. Mm -hmm. At least we have a source of water. I wonder if it works in the real life you can place a cloth or tap a tarp I'm I'm skeptic about the cloth because the heat would evaporate the moisture if you use cloth 
I'm familiar with the concept that the moisture from the ground when you put on some leaves it's going to evaporate maybe because of the the greenhouse effect that it creates uh, on the ground and then causes the moisture to evaporate from the ground and up to the tarp if tarp yes it, it could because the the moisture can evaporate away they would just be trapped on the on the the under surface of the tarp and then mm -hmm, another one they could just uh how do you do that Pre precipitate in time and they would run to the to the because it's on a diagonal or slanted towards the center where they catch the coconut or maybe any container is situated or positioned it could really gather a good amount of water because back in the day we have so many coconut trees in our province and then I'm very familiar that when you gather some uh, leaves or any perhaps also the the the, the, the what do you call that the, the coconut fruit if you just pile them up when you when you, when you dismantle the, the the pile you would find that the ground is moist 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 and there's moisture but I have of course because this uh, strategy is this game is in in the Pacific so it's a tropical tropical climate usually the, the ground is maybe dry in a very top surface but the under air the dry surface is very moist you could almost uh, you could take with your hands up to that level and then you'd find worms earthworms so it's that thin uh, the moisture another bird snare because we are having a shortage of food we're short in food supply we are not uh, gonna be using our potatoes uh, so may maybe a few episodes in the future we, we can use the potatoes as for, for food consumption but as of now I am multiplying them cultivating I want them to get as many as possible and I also I'm also wondering why you can only plant one one potato in a very huge space and get only one because you can plant in a pail maybe yeah just a very simple small pail you can plant maybe 10 potatoes in it and then after a few months it will bear so many leaves and then you can harvest that that pail of potato just that very small space it would fill the pail that's how potatoes can grow and such a very small space Whoa. but in this game uh, uh, it's not that realistic one potato plant in a how do you say I think it's more 1.3 
meter, square meter. Or maybe, let's see, five. Five or four square, square feet. Four square feet. One potato plant for every four square feet. Well, I hope in the future the this it would also make sense if it gets longer. Maybe every three months you can harvest, but also with with as many. I hope the developers can configure this, make it more hard, make it more realistic. I love this game for this this the touch of it that it's close to reality we got this here all right and it's night already stuff mm -hmm. okay we have water skin now we can we can travel with with, a, with water with us The pig hasn't respond yet. Little pig. Little pig. Where's my little pig? It hasn't respond yet. Why is it hasn't respond? Because there's no lightning. Why don't you make one? I cannot make lightning. Maybe you can ask Thor. Gonna take my wooden spears and maybe head out to another island. Okay. Going north. You can go north. Hmm? What to say guys? Uh, I lost of uh, where where we've been. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Retreat and released. All right, we are floating. This is so good. Yeah. We're going out there. Mm-hmm. Oh. Whoa, what we should do? We can Okay. Didn't see that one. Maybe we could also attach some some torch or flashlight ahead of the 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 raft. So we could uh, we could at least see the the front view of where we are going. North is there. Uh, that that island there's a shade shadow somewhere there mm -hmm. they finally play the sound effect 
operate. Mm -hmm. I thought there's a shadow or shade of an island. Mm. Bye, home. Goodbye. I'm gonna be alone again. I miss my kids. I miss my wife. Freaking plane crash. I am not getting anywhere. Where am I going? I'm just heading straight to north. Straight to north. And nothing yet. Nothing yet. Something should show up. Come on. Show me something. Is that land? Looks like an uh, island. It looks like an island. Please. Not just a mirage. Is it an island? Is it? There's nothing behind me. Okay. Oh, it's an island. Oh, yes. Finally. Okay, we're gonna... To this sunken boat first, or maybe ship. It's a ship, a mother ship. Old crews reporting. We can use our anchor. Lower the boat. Okay, gonna drop something. Yep. Yep. Can we jump in there? Yes, we can. Something must be in here. But it's nothing. We can climb. There's a stair, but we can climb. Oh, uh hi. -huh. This year. Oh dear. I'm going down and to the waters. Hope there's no shark. Scary. Scary Jerry. Put my hammer. 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 And gonna go for the boy balls. So we could add more to our raft. I'll take my lantern. Maybe go there. Nope, 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 nope. Nope. We go there, there, there. Here, here. Oh, yes. I think this is good enough. Now just a bit near to the boy balls or maybe you can do this. Alright. Uh-huh. Get the balls, get the balls, get the balls. Get the balls. The balls. Or the other. Come on. Come on. 
Don't go anywhere. Okay. The water's cold. It's so cold in here. And dark. Anyway, I think there's nothing. There's nothing more. Oh, there's another one. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's, that's very far. Come here, come here. Uh. Freaking boy balls. And we're gonna get those or hammer. Do a little. And forward. Forward. Alright. We did what we want to do. That's nice. I really want to go up. Maybe it's not with the mechanics of the game. So let's go ashore. Float away. Just float away. And mm hmm we really hit that one, huh? And we're turning. <laughs> What is happening? Okay, I'm gonna follow a little bit on the moon. Mm hmm not, not there. I hope I won't. Yep, we didn't hit something. So we're heading straight for the shore. Get to a little closing. This is a good spot. I hope there's no snakes and no giant crabs. Well, giant crabs can be handy. So there is home. Home is south. Home is south. Yep. So we're gonna survey around the island. Survey around. There's the crab. The crab for crab. It's coming for us. And oh, okay, it's another one, huh? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One. Whoa. Okay, I'm gonna battle you. Battle with you. We still have enough life. Mm -hmm. By the way, this crab, a size of this crab can cut through your uh, your fingers like butter and your hand like a banana. Oh my god. Only three, three bars left. That crab really did us. Mm -hmm. I hope we can be build a smoker here and save their meat. We have so many boys. We have 10 and we can build another 2 for our... Hey, don't go far. Slowly with this. Okay. Gonna find some latchings. La. Alright. Get some sticks out of this. Cocos. Going to 
build a water water still it's day 15 and we managed to survive we are doing a great job surviving guys I only need one we have the tarp we have the cocoa and we have latching just stones some stones okay I think that's all but there is okay that one more okay another one yes I build more latchings for the for the floater Alright, just the stones. Maybe we can drop this and get some stones. And we're up to the task. Alright, put this one here to do it. Money for nothing and chicks for free. Beat it with, with fronts. Stay for uh, stay. Uh, wait. All we have to do is wait. We can build a shelter. Need another latching. Hey, let me go. Mm-hmm. Chains. And after this we're gonna build our shelter and we're good and we found a pig. We're good and we are going to build our floating uh, call I don't know what the the balls the boy balls okay but this is it for now guys it's been fun and also long so like and subscribe and put your comments below, share if you want, and hit the notification bell. It's... that's good, huh? <laughs>